Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the Marilyn Darling Show, and welcome to another episode of 38 30 Days. How is everyone doing today? Are you having a nice day? I have to do this really quickly because I have a dentist appointment in like an hour, and I have to leave soon. So, <clears throat> thanks a lot to Bar Gary and Kathy Scott for providing the sample for this review. Today, we are doing Birmingham Muskrat. It is a brown ink. Here is our comparison panel. Today's pen will be using the Conklin Demograph with a 1.1 millimeter stub. Here is our ink swatch and water resistance test shows that I would totally use this on the outside of an envelope because it doesn't have, it has lots of um, water resistance. Okay, so here is our toilet paper chromatography and I see a brown and then I see orange and then I see a lighter orange and then I see a yellow. So this is a very flavorful ink. Check that out. Wow. All right. Here is the pen and gear memo book from walmart.com. No feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. Lightweight traveler's notebook paper. No feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. Super lightweight traveler's notebook paper. No feathering, normal ghosting. <coughs> Moleskin. 70 GSM, feather like a chicken, blend through the page. I would not use fountain pen ink in that paper. A Yush 100 GSM paper, no feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. 52 GSM Tomoe River, no feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. <clears throat> the Jot Journal from the Dollar Tree, a little bit of feathering, a little bit of ghosting. That's too bad. Buffet, handmade paper from Italy, no feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. Rhodia dot pad, 80 GSM, no feathering, no bleeding, a little bit of ghosting though. <clears throat> the Nanami 7C, 68 GSM, Tomoe River, no feathering, no bleeding, no ghosting. Marmon Demosceny, 80 GSM dot grid, no feathering, Tiny bit of ghosting. Oxford Optic Paper. No feathering. Little bit of ghosting. Claire Fontaine. No feathering. Tiny bit of ghosting. Hi, Butterbean Head. How are you doing today? Lamy Booklet. 90 GSM. Tiny bits of feathering. And a little bit of ghosting. I am in a hurry today. Exceed 100 GSM paper from Walmart.com. No feathering, little bit of ghosting. Unison composition book from Target.com. Feather like a chicken. Bled through the page. Up and up composition book from Target.com. No feathering. Bare, barely any ghosting. CVS Caliber Notebook Paper. No feathering, no bleeding, no gusting. Oxford Notebook Paper. No feathering, no bleeding, no gusting. I'm in a hurry. <clears throat> Mead Wide Roll Notebook Paper. Feather like a chicken, bled through the page. Mead Five Star Notebook Paper. Feather like a chicken, ghosted through the page. HP Premium, 32 pound copy paper, feather like a chick, um, feather a little bit and barely any ghosting. Acabee cross section pad, barely any feathering and it did ghost through the page. J&B copper plate graph pad from johnneilbooks.com, no feathering but it did ghost through the page. Original crown mill, 100 GSM paper, a little bit of feathering and it did ghost through the page. Okay, let's do a comparison panel really quick. All right. I'm going to try and go through these very quickly. So, if you have to pause and go back, please do. Platinum Sepia Black, Sepia, Whaleman Sepia, Rome Burning, Queen of Hearts, Red Black, Ancre, Brune, Brown Sugar, Hippo Purple, Beaver, Vampire Red, 
uh, William Shakespeare, Monarca, Tiala Colorada, Lee de Tay, Chocolate Brown, Carcass Brown, Pumpkin Cake, Winter Spice, Beaver Dam Brown, Summer Solstice, Becky, Walnut, Nightshade, Crystal Topaz, Polar Brown, uh, Gitinia Barna, Ochre, Scotch Brown, Coco de Brazil, Chocolate Pudding, Raw Sienna, Umi Murasaki, Autumn Oak, Cognac Brown, Terracotta, uh, Brandy Snap, Golden Brown, Golden Brown, Sepia, Nude, Saddle Brown, Document Urban Sienna, Kiowa Pecan, and SBRA Brown. Probably the fastest I've ever done a review in my entire life, and I'm so sorry. But I have a dentist appointment to get to, so that is all for today. I want to thank you all for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed this one. I hope that you learned something. Please share this video with your friends. Follow me on social media. Like, comment, subscribe. Ring the little bell. Make sure it's set to all so when I upload new content, YouTube notifies you, and I will be back very soon with another video. So take care.